Hey everyone, welcome to the episode of the War of the Realms. I forgot what we're doing for a second, because I always do when I do it's this intro. It's Sigmar, Steve. I know. Well, I actually don't think, <laughs> so everybody knows, I actually don't think about what I'm doing from the camera on. I just start talking, which is probably not a good thing, but I'm rambling now. So we're going to do 2,000 <laughs> points of, I'm going to bring Dark Elves for the first time here at Mini War Gaming because we have some new Dark Elves in the studio, so I'm going to give them a try. And I'm going up against Chaos. Looks yep. like uh, mostly Zinch. Zinchy Chaos. I'm Zinchy excited chaos. to face these guys. I've never played against Dark Elves. I hope I get nothing wrong. I uh, first time with them, so I probably will forget rules. So leave a comment below, correct me on them if I do. We're doing a gift from the heaven scenario. Yeah. Let's look at the armies, then deploy. Here is my 2,000 points of dark elves. We're bringing 30 witch elves. We have two units of dark spears, or sorry, dark shards, 15 of them, a 20 minute unit of dark spears, shades of hydra, uh, lord on a black dragon. <laughs> uh, Reaper, Reaper Bolt Thrower, and we have the Cauldron here with my general. I'm gonna take the Phoenix Stone and um, Legendary Fighter. Is that the right one? I already forget. Master of Defense. So the extra way to ignore wounds and then extra wound over hero phase. And I also have a few less points than Gwyn, so I'll get myself um, Bloody Fighter. What does that one do? It's, um, it's the. I rolled a three. It's the one where once per game, one of my units can reroll all fail to wound in combat. Or all fail to wound doesn't say in combat. And over here we have Chaos. What do we have in here? I have a pretty straightforward army today. I have two units of 20 Chaos Warriors. Uh, Mark of Zinch, but it doesn't really matter. I have Kairos. I have the uh, Lord of Change, who is my general. He's going to have the Crown of Command. And Dark Avenger, which is a 10-inch bubble of plus one to hit order. Ooh, okay. I have a unit of 30 Pink Horrors. And a Soul Grander. Yeah, pretty nasty, but pretty good. We got magic, we got speed. And I got bodies. Shooting, we got defense. It's just an all round kind of balanced list. Yeah, I'll see your army. Yep. And we have deployed in the city swamps. I finished deploying second. I have crossbows, crossbows, and spears over here. The witch elves and the cauldron hold in the center with a hydra and a dragon on the flanks. Bolt throw in the rear. Across the field, we have pink horrors, warriors of chaos, the devastating war engine, more warriors of chaos, and Kiros and his lackey. But I also have. The ace in the hole. Watch them win the game for me. Maybe. No. <laughs> they hide over here. So, so get swapped yeah. by a soul grinder. <laughs> the meteor's gonna hit right over here. They're gonna just hold it. All right, so you finished playing first, Gwyn. Who would like to go first for battle round one? You go first. Yeah, I know. I don't wanna go first. I will go first. So we have some hero phase abilities to do. First of all, I'm going to drink from the chalice. So I'm gonna drink the witch brew, actually. That's what it is. And I will get the reroll ones to wound and I can more battle shock. My generals use their command ability to give them the ability to pile in twice. That's called the Orgy of Slaughter. And then she's going to pray for the strength of Cain for these witch elves here. Basically roll a die on a 2 plus. Uh, they get two. I forget. <laughs> I think they got It's plus one to wound in combat, but if I roll a one, they just take a mortal wound instead. Nope. They get... So now they are plus one to wound, re-roll into wound of one and piling and attacking twice. We're gonna fly the dragon straight on forward. We'll throw it on a charge, because why not? We're gonna run the spears, even though I probably wanna keep them back a bit. Whoop, I'm moving terrain. I just wanna keep them here in case the meter comes out on this side, but I want them to be able to switch sides if necessary. If the meter does not come over here, so we'll start shifting them this way with a bit of a run. Hydra, we're gonna go send them up, take some hits. He's gonna run an extra five. We're going to bring them this way. Witch elves are going to run the move of whopping seven already. Plus five, wow. There, we are going to run these dark shards. These dark shards are also going to run. Ooh, anywhere they want. But we're going to tuck up behind the building for now. Because we don't know where that gift from the heavens is coming from. And we'll run the shades. Oh, oh they, they, they're they going to stay right there. Yeah. And the cauldron run, sure. No, I'm not going to run. We're just going to stop here to keep everybody in the bubble. Shooting time. Reaper Bolt Thor is going to go for the pink horrors. It's hitting on fours. It did okay. Ooh, on threes. Hey, nice. did very well. It has a ren, but I don't think that matters to you. Uh, yeah. Oh, it doesn't matter. Six up shades because of the ren. Hey, One. I'll take it. So that's five gone. With the bases that I don't like it. Yeah, that's just the first thing you do is kill the guys with crappy bases. Or googly eyes. Uh, and there's that's one that rule. wants to fall over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 
with that ending shooting we're going to go right on to charge i have one possible charge a 12 inch charge will make it to the warriors with the dragon so i might as well go for it um i'm not sorry <laughs> <laughs> Is it in? There's a little part of me that just wants to be a jerk and have Kairos to make those a one. Oh, right. And leave you hanging and blow the Oh, I forgot all about that ability. I think wouldn't they make the charge? <laughs> <laughs> you gonna use it? Is he pretty tough? And, yeah, because he's got that more. He is a dragon. Him. Boom. That is now a one, and that's a fail charge. And that Kairos. ends my turn. Yep. So that is once per game ability from Kairos Fate Weaver. Take a die and make it any number you want. Turn one for chaos. Hero phase. Hero phase, yes. Yeah, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Just checking line of sight. Yeah. All right. Do you have any shenanigans in the hero phase here? No big shenanigans. No big shenanigans? Uh, you have to spell things backwards at all? <laughs> if you have to, you don't have to do <laughs> it. Just stand on my head. <laughs> jump up and down. No. Uh, all right, where are we going? Right. The Lord of Change is my general with the Chrono Command, so I get two command abilities. Right. He's going to pop his add one to all of your casting. Yep, in, makes uh, sense. A certain amount of inches, I can look that up. And uh, he's going to put Inspiring Presence on the warriors out front. Also makes sense. Who are these guys? So I'm going to do some magic now. I'm going to do the gate. It's a gate of... Gate of Infinity. Gate of Infinity, yeah. Um, I've already measured. I have range on you. What does it do? Uh, if I get it, which I probably You're going to get it because you take a die and you max the high. Yeah, 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 it's getting off. And I get yeah. plus one. Or plus, yeah, anyway. Nine nine dice, three ups and a mortal wound. Oh, ouch. Yeah. So it's... Seven to cast? Yeah, and I got yeah. the name wrong. Um, for Infernal? Some reason, Infernal Gate. Infernal Gate. Gate of Infinity. I don't know what that's from. Um... All right, so it's eight. And you just die matches, correct? Yeah, so I turn one of my dice to match. The highest, so it's now it's an eight. Eight, and then there we Plus go. one. Plus it's one. It's a nine to cast. Ability. So I need a ten to unbind, but I don't have anything to unbind. Yep. That's going to go off. So that's nine dice against my lord there. And every three is a mortal wound. This is going to be some mortal wounds. One, two, three, four, six mortal six wounds. Mortal wounds. Dropping him down. I'm also going to throw an arcane bolt at the same yeah. target. You got it. Got it with a 13. Yeah, I can't mind. <laughs> D3 mortal wounds. Another two. two. Oh, he done six. Didn't he have some sort of save? Oh, wait a second. Yeah, I'm within line of the cauldron here after I'm moving all the train and everything. I have six ups. Ignore all those mortal wounds. If he wasn't in nine. Yeah, sorry, from my uh, aura from the. Shrine here, on a six I ignore all those mortal wounds. I get two wounds back. That's not bad. Back up to eight. No. Oh, we're doing Mystic Shield? Yeah, Mystic Shield on, sorry, on the uh, the Chaos Warriors from Kairos. Yep. He's got like a plus three and he turns, so. Yeah, so that one becomes a four, because, no, no so it's, it's a, yeah. Three's match, but plus three right now, because he yeah. usually gets plus two and then plus one for the ability, so I'm Either nine. way, that's plenty, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Before we go into the movement phase, we have to go back a sec. Uh, it was battle shock because guys were lost from the pink cores, and though nobody can flee, they can regenerate with a one. And actually, you did six. So if I roll a six, I think you'll five. You made five. one oh, save. Five. Yeah, so, so you should be pretty one safe. One no, no, nothing comes back. So moving on to movement. Pink yep. cores are coming on forward. Warriors of chaos are gonna run. An extra two. So they're going seven inches. Protecting the pink cores to my frustration. And these warriors as each are also going to run, they're a little bit faster. Eight inches. Yeah. Shuffle up to here. Hello. And now the birds in the back got to do their thing. Yeah. Come out in the open. Come out in the open. I think I can still keep that line of sight. Dang. One pops out this way. And the other Kuros is going into the annex little walkway. I think he's gonna hang out here. Looking for a safe spot. Safe-ish. Safe-ish. Yeah. <laughs> Time for shooting pink whores and a player all their pink whore goodness at this dragon. Yeah, so that'll be... Hitting them on threes. With forced one. wound, you got one stray. Oh, thank you. Decent amount of wounds. The dragon has a four up save, which did stupidly well, which is rerollable. Oh no. And then on a six, we ignore damage. You've taken two more two. wounds. Down to six. I think that's something that some Chaos Warriors have. Next to Soul Grinders in the shoot. I have the, uh, what's it called? Reaper. 
Reaper. Reaper. No, Harvest Cannon. Oh, Harvest, Harvest Cannon on his wrist. Is he going after my Dark Shirt or sticking out? Yep. D6 shots. One. <laughs> Hitting on fours. That's it. Winning on three. Gets it with a minus one rend. I have a six up save against that. And in the shooting phase, I reroll ones and twos. And it's still a one. Next, his phlegm bombardment's going after him. Hit on a four. Ooh, that's a hit. Looking for a three now. That's a wound. And that's got a minus two rend. That's going to be no save. With a three wounds. Three wounds, ouch. One, two, three. Cool. We have Bravery of Six. We've lost four models, but we also have um, more than 10 models in there. That's going to send two more scurrying away. With that concluding turn one, we're going on to battle round turn two. Season to go first. Actually, I th yeah, we had to finish going first. I'm going to take the double turn on you, Steve. Definitely. And now a um, gift from the heavens comes down as well. So in the center of one of these three zones, a marker is going to come down. So we'll go one, two, three. So this one here, right dead center, is an objective worth two points on turn two, three points on turn three, and so on. My turn one will come down on my side as well. Hero phase, turn two. Very similar, gonna pop both command abilities, keep them inspired and give the plus one to my casting. Makes sense. Uh, actually, no, it doesn't. I am going to make them inspired as well. So both my units are inspired oh, okay. from the crown of command. Gotcha. Because I see some fighting happening There's over fighting here. There's right. Which do you want to cast first? How many, he's got six wounds left? Six wounds left. I will do Infernal Gateway. Infernal Gateway. I need double ones here to pretty much stop this. Maybe you'd... No, that's definitely going to go off. Yeah, it goes off with 10, 11. Yeah. Three plus or mortal wounds. Ooh, that's all of them. Yep. On a six up, we ignore it. No, he's dead. <laughs> nice. Blah. And the Fate Weavers to put Mystic Shield onto the Warriors up front. Successfully. Yep. Movement time. The Warriors are going to run now. Six An inches. extra six. Whoo. Making the wall. With their 11 inch run, they can keep shooting. Just gonna walk forward. Just so the pink horse and zap things. Boom. Running Kairos. 13 inches. And they're flying. Center, oh, center. this is the Fate Weaver. Oh. The other one? This is the one that I meant to. I, oh, did you I get a mixed Kairos. Up? Yeah, I, yeah. I meant um, Lord of Change. And he flies, so I can pop him up here. And I'm just going to confirm that I'm out of range of the... Oh, you're definitely out of range. Yeah. Um, definitely barely, actually. What's its movement? You're welcome over here. It's oh. 36. Oh, I can move four or six. Yeah, so I'm technically still in range if you decided to move it this way. Want to hide behind the build or behind the rock or the wood? Yeah, I'm going to just pop back a couple more inches. To... Nope, going for it. Stay on top. Risking yep. it. Risking it. Soul Grinder's gonna move up a whopping 12, actually. That's pretty good. That's quite scary. Oops. Oh yeah, little warriors. <laughs> These guys are just gonna shuffle forward a bit. They're pinned down a few things. We're just waiting. Let's see. <laughs> oh, last we got Kairos here. Is he He's gonna, gonna run? run. Oof, he has lots of movement. Yeah. Going this way. Shoot on a shrinker. At your witches? Horrors going for the witches! What? And they're hitting on twos because they're close to the uh, lower change over here. Twos. twos. There's a few ones, so I'll take it. And then fours. Blue lots. And those witches ignore the damage on a five or a six. Saving two. <laughs> two, four, six, eight, ten dead. Nice. We're gonna go three. No, that was only two. Here's three. Seven. I'm not sure which way we're going yet. So we'll just split the difference. The Soul Grinder's also going to shoot at them. He's cannon. D6 of the Hearts Cannon. It's going to get three, three shots. shots. Hitting on fours. I'm rolling pretty All right. good with him. <laughs> three hits. Wounded on threes, if I recall. I'll double check that, though. Three's the wound. Three. Minus one rend, but I don't think it matters. Yeah, not this age. Are they just ignore the damage on a five, six? Hey, only one. It's only one damage? Yeah. Yoink. And I'm going to... Flem bombardment, fours and threes. 
Mrs. Mrs. Beautiful. One. Uh, that'll end the shooting phase. We have a charge coming from the Soul Grinder. It's in. Yeah. Boop. Coming into my uh, dark shards. Yeah. With this being the only thing that can attack. It's gonna attack. Start with the piston driven legs. These are six attacks. Fours and threes. Fours for the pistons. A lot of hits. Three hits. And three is the wound. Oh. Uh, the. Oh, the chaos thing. Yes. We, oh, we talked about it too. We on did. a six plus, it's plus one to wound? Uh, plus one to hit? Is there a range on the general for it though? That's actually. Weird. Never mind. Not close enough for me to another character for the uh, chaos allegiance Still ability. Three hits. Three hits though, yeah. Three is to wound. One wound. One wound. Minus one rend. Give me a six up. Nope. How much damage? Uh, that is just one. Just one? But I have a Hellforged Claw. The Hellforged Claw is coming up next. Just one attack, fours and threes again. Ooh, no. Misses. Warp Metal Blade. Warp Metal Blade is coming up. Uh, two attacks, fours and threes. One hit. Mm, nothing. Nothing. All your attacks? That's all of my attacks. Okay. Interesting. We're going to pile in the deck. My guys attack back on fives. Hey. Half hit. And fives. Half the wound. Two wound. Four up save. That was a drop die. Can we get this? Can we do more damage? Hey, we did One. equal damage. <laughs> <laughs> and that'll be it. That's the top of turn two. So I'm going to go to my turn two. And first I have to get a gift from the heavens to see where that meteor's going to come down. One, two, three. It's coming down over here. That's where my meteor hit and I have to protect that. And uh, that's pretty good because it didn't knock down the building somehow. Yeah. Okay, we have to mop up a lot of things. So we're going to first drink the witch's brew. And we're good. Sorry, that's called the strength of Cain. The witch's brew does not require a roll. And then, oh, command ability orgy slaughter on the witch elves. On movement, I'm going to have my spears run back. We're gonna bring the Hydra mm -hmm. right about here. That seems reasonable. The Witch Elves are gonna move that way. Cauldron's gonna run. Extra five. Plenty to get to here. These Dark Shards are going to charge. Or sorry, run. Because uh, I'm gonna hide them in the building and pop out next turn. Hopefully with a 10 inch move. These Shades are going for an annoyance move. They're going to assassinate or draw fire. Bolt throwers going to go up. That's that. So let's do some shooting. Shooting phase. Hydra's going to fire at the warriors right in front of them. Six shots from the fire breath. Hitting on threes. One misses. It's wounding on threes. One fails the wound. So four wounds on the warriors with a rend. Uh, one. One. So that gives them a five up save. Uh, uh, take three. Take uh, three. Three wounds, so one dies and one takes a wound. These dark shards are fire into the soul grinder. They're hitting on fives. With hey, I'll take the five hits. Yeah. Ooh, neon fives. Will one wound. Four save, I believe. Yep. No rend. No rend. Got it. All saved. Shades are going after Kiros here. They're hitting on fours so because they're better. We have statistically the half hits. So I flipped that die. It's not a hit. And four's the wound. Hey. Four wounds. Ooh, I think he's only got a five up save. Whew, I'll take it. But and only taking two that wounds. For two wounds on him. So that was a four up save, so he made one more save. Boss curls going for him too. It's hitting on a four. Ooh, I like it. Wounding curls on a three. We got five. five. There's a five up save because of Rend. And saving one. So four wounds on him. With that being all my shooting, we're gonna charge. The Hydra is going to charge first. I'm going to use three dice using my Beastmaster's a whip and good. If I roll triples, I take a mortal wound and I fail the charge. Okay, we're in. <laughs> I just want to do this. Stop the warrior wall from moving. Cool. Witch elves are going to charge. Oh, we're definitely rolling this. Eight? I hope so. Yeah, there sure. Boom, so now the witches are going to go first. Get in the like so. A lot of attacks, stacking a bunch of abilities, basically hitting on threes. And after this, after stacking all the abilities, they're wounding on twos. Mm. I'm seeing some ones, that makes me happy. Not too bad. Just shy of being able to reroll ones to hit. <laughs> no rend on this stuff? No rend, so four up save. Come on. 
killing four more of those warriors and leaving one with a wound. So the warriors are now piling an attack now because those witches are able to pile an attack again. I think the only one. Now the Chaos Warriors are attacked, they're hitting on threes. The champion has the two red dice, he's hitting, hitting on, on twos. twos. This is pretty scary, because they can do pretty good. Yeah. Unbuffed. I should do a bunch. But they're Chaos Warriors, they should be combat beefy. Threes. A lot of hits. Yep. We're looking I'm for fours for fours now though, so. Here's where it all goes down here. Darn it. I'm within eight inches of the hero, I could have rolled for extra hit. Right. Oh, actually, okay. do it now. Roll die on a six-up. We'll just check the dice. No, we don't check nothing. The chaos ability. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Well, the cauldron's gonna save me. I can roll this many fives as well. Oh, I can't. So that's gonna kill three, six, eight witches. Yeah. Two, four, six, eight. Actually, leave the champion alive. Yeah. We'll kill this one. I'm gonna send the dark shards next. Fives and fives. One four of save. Do you want to pile anyone else in on that? I'm oh, good with a four. Yeah, now you're good. Warriors gonna come in to fight the Hydra now. Four of them getting in eight attacks. I'm rolling for my six. Oh yes, chaos ability. Nope. So hitting on threes. Fair amount hits. Four is the wound. Lots of wounds. Four of save. Hey, they two make do. He's down to 10 wounds. I'm gonna have the witches pile in and attack again before the Hydra attacks. I don't think the champion's gonna make it. I think they're all good now though. Hitting on threes. Ugh. And twos. Uh oh. Six ones. All right. Four of save for these Chaos Warriors. Still a lot of saves to make. And killing three more of them warriors. What is pulling them out of the Hydra? Because there's no more alternating combat to do, we just have a couple of guys left to each. I'll finish up all of mine because they won't affect each other, so the Hydra will attack those warriors. Fangs are hitting on fours and wounding on threes with a rend. Uh, one? Yep, five up save. Make one fail one, and it's D3 wounds. It's two, kills up one warrior. Quad limbs hitting on threes and whoop, and threes, nope. And then the Beastmasters, fours and fours, two wounds, no rend, four up save. You're good. So now we have the Soul Grinder. Yeah. Piston driven legs are first. D6 of these? No, six of these. Uh, fours and three. Hitting on fours. No, one. Oof. Wounding on threes. There's one. Yeah. Rend? Uh, Just one? Rend of minus one. Six up. We know the damage on a six. Oh, you know what we forgot about? What? No, 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 I never did. Never did. Nope, nope. one dead. One dead. What did you forget about? Get Hellforge days. Claw! Hit on a four. No. Nope. nope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and the Warp Made Will Blade, there are two of them again. Four up, three up. Hey! One hit. Three up. Is there Got a rend? It. Yeah, this is a rend of minus two. No save. D uh, three die. Three damage. So on a six, we ignore those. Nope, three die. With them, you only one with Battle Shock. Everything we else got inspired. Bravery of six, and we lost four models. Okay. Six gone. Two more. And at the end of Battle Round Two, that? our score. <laughs> at the end of Battle Round Two, I'm holding this piece of meteor. Gwyn's holding that one. It's going to be a tie game. It's going to come down to kill points, and I'm slowly getting grounded down. Not by the Soul Grinder, mind you, but by the other yeah. things. Keeping the score tied, we're going on to turn three. Who's gonna go first? I think the elves really, really need it. <laughs> That's my die. Everybody saw that. <laughs> Nobody. Turn three for chaos. Hero phase. What's happening first? Um, Lord of Change is gonna do command abilities. Yep. Um, we're gonna put inspiring presence on these two units. Two units. Yeah. Okay. I don't think. I don't, we're gonna put uh, mystic. Shield onto the warriors. The warriors are getting it. Uh, four? four? Not enough. No, nice. Mystic Shield is <laughs> actually not cast by Zinch for a change. Arcane Bolt over to the Hydra. Successfully. That goes off with a um, 12. I don't think I'm in range to unbind. 
No. That is D3 mortal wounds. Two. Two. Down to eight. Uh, Mystic Bolt, the Hydra. Oh, uh, Mystic Bolt. This is the his personal one? Yep. Yep. Rolling an eight. eight. Is it plus one as well? Uh, plus two. Plus two. So it's technically a ten. A ten. Uh, I'm just out of range down bind anyway, right. so I can't really stop this it. Is a D3. Another D3 more wounds. Three. Three. Ooh. That's a hurting. Down to five. Good. Whomp. Taking us there, to crossbows? the uh, 16. Taking us to the movement phase. Everybody's trying to try to get away from the bows, but I think it's a good time to break my back. Actually, they're lucky enough protecting me by being trapped in combat. With the Hydra. Yeah. Actually, they're going to flee. Oh, that, that'll work. Are they going to run? They're, yeah, they're going to run. Run and flee the warriors. And... Getting an extra three. three. So they've got five plus three. And with the hornblower, they get plus one oh, to run. Oh, right. Start up tonight. Getting all the way around the side of the building and opening up a pretty nice gap. Why aren't you just going to run? Two. So he flies pretty far. Add an extra two. Inches. Stop going into this side of the board. If you get there, I can't hold it. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and the Fate Weaver is going to run. I'll pause that. Scratch that. He's not going to run. He's going for combat. Going to stay three inches away from the Hydra and hoping to finish Plenty the Hydra of off. And the Pink Horrors are hoping to shoot down that Hydra. Yeah, everyone's already in range. What's the range on these guys? Only 16, and they move six. Uh, they are going to come forward a bit. Right, they're shooting the pink whores and a fire into the Hydra. Hitting on twos because I'm order and there's a bunch of them. Hey, I see, a, I see a lot of yeah. ones. Four up to wound with a four up save and see if I can survive this. Ooh, ooh I think I'm going to be okay. Four up save. Oh no, wait. Oh, I got one wound left. <laughs> Down to one. So this guy's gonna try to finish him off. Right now for the flame bombardment. Uh, first I'll do the Reaper? harvester, harvester cannon. Yeah. D six shots. Yep. It's four. Four shots, fours and threes. Hitting on fours. Mm, oh, let's rock. Mm, one. one hit. Three's a wound. Nothing. One, and then the flame bombardment. Fours and threes again. This guy's been doing spectacular. Whoa. He does nothing. <laughs> the Hydra lives. For now. Time to charge. Fit we were coming in. Oh yeah, you're in. And jumping over the charge with his wings. Fate Weaver is gonna risk it, and well, not risk it, but he needs to go attack first and yeah. kill that Hydra. So with the staff of tomorrow, I get a D6 attacks. Ooh. Six. Oh. And they're hitting on fours. Ooh, just above half. We have four hits. Why three's the wound. Harvest cannon do this. I so. know. Yeah, uh, three. Because <laughs> of Ren, five up. He's still alive. No, he's dead. Nice. And he takes. So many wounds. Five, six wounds. <laughs> witches. Oh, the witch is attacking back. Oh, I forget what. Is it? And we're wounding on twos because everything is still. Ooh, nice. Only one fail. <laughs> the four up armors. <laughs> too many dice. <laughs> I might be okay. Oh no, you did fine. <laughs> you did really well. One killing just the four of them. And uh, then they will now attack back because I get to attack back for like, twice. Eight of them. Hitting on threes, but the champion's hitting on twos, which actually helped. Yeah. I'm looking for fours. Don't kill me. Kill them. Oh, oh, I like it. Three, four, five. We know the damage on a five plus because of the cult. I hate that cauldron. Only three. We're going to kill this one, this one, and this one. I rolled all my fours. So I'm going to attack with these two guys who are amazing. Watch it on fives. Of course, one hits. Wounds on five. Definitely not a wound, okay. Ah, it's your attack back, you uh, didn't see in two rounds of combat, you killed, what, three of them? Yeah. <laughs> I'll be fine, I'll be fine. Starting off with a piston-driven leg, six attacks. Fours and threes. <laughs> Consistently hitting one hit with it. Threes to hit a wound. No <laughs> wound, okay. You have a big claw. Yeah, one attack, fours and threes. It's like it's... It hits, Whoa. threes to wound. There's yeah. a wound. This is the two rend, right? This two rend. Uh, the six up. Oh, how much damage? D six. D six. Oh, how much? Go ahead and go oh, right yeah. to my armor. One damage, which I ignore in a six. No. no. One yoink. Dies. Then you have um, one more attack. The sword. Sword has two attacks hitting on fours, 
And we're doing one. threes. Okay. So I'm attacking my witches again. Come on, witches, hitting on threes. What are you on twos? Oh, there's some ones this time. This time we got six. Oh, the four save. Looking for fours. And we're doing two, two and a half. I'll take and a half. There's already half gone. So beautiful. So after combat, I have a battle shock right here on a six. He's out of there. No, he's good. He's gonna hold that demon forever. Bravery of seven with the standard bearer for the chaos wars. They lost seven models, so D six guys are gonna flee. D six minus one. They lost six models. They lost six. Oh, you're right. Seven models. Oh, D six guys. Are, roll six. Three. Nah, three of them are just taken off. But it will hold me in place. It's pretty good. Taking it right to my turn, so drinking the Witch's Brew, uh, two plus something, we're good, and the pile on attack twice. So that was, we're drinking the brew, oh, we're gonna be immune to Battle Shock, we have an extra attack being 14 with her, within this hero here, we pile on attack twice. Still pretty deadly, but I don't know, I think it's time to go straight up the field. We're gonna send the Cauldron after the Fate Weaver. These shades are gonna run. An extra three. I'm putting these guys up. Keeping them all within six. Making this difficult. Well, scratch, instead of moving forward, I'll run just to make it all legal. I can move 12 inches. I'm gonna move, keep one model within six and the rest farther away. So I'll go that way. As long as that guy doesn't die, we're staying on the objective. I'm gonna move forward. Scratch that, it's better if I stay pretty much right where I am so I wanna be able to cover both sides if one model just skirt over this way. So, shooting phase, we're gonna fire two crossbows into the slow grinder. We got a hit. We got a wound. Four up. We got a wound. <laughs> oh, these crossbows. The dark shards are gonna go after the pink horrors. That's 30 shots hitting on fives because we're not that good at shooting. And a four to wound. Okay. That yeah, not, not terrible. Five up save for those pink horrors. Are we sure? Okay. Yeah. Well, let's save three of them. A lot of dead. Okay, I like it. And then I'll put the big old boss crow, the reaper boss crow, into the fate weaver. Hitting on fours. Wounding on threes. Three five saves. Oh, take them all. Down the tunes. Yep. Time to charge. We're going to send the chariot here try to get into combat. Uh, we're in. Oh, wowzers. All right, we're going for heroes. Actually, we might as well go this way. Say out of three, but get on the objective. I think I might need the witches, so they're gonna attack first. Hitting on threes. Wounding on twos. Uh, four up. save. I can do it. I nice. can't do it. Think they're dead. We got them. Yeah. Fate Weaver's attacking my Cauldron of Wood now. All right. Staff of Tomorrow has D6 attacks. A one attack. Hitting on a four. No, wounding on a four, sorry. Yeah, oh. hitting on a four, wounding on a four. Wars and boards. Oh, we got, got a five. That's it. And that's no wound. And then beaks and claws. Fours and threes. One hit. No wound. That guy's gonna go next. He's sitting on a five. No, okay. <laughs> you can attack him now. So piston, six attacks, hitting one lowly dark shard. On fours. All right, who wants to lay money on this one? Uh, maybe now we're gonna kill somebody. It's not now. <laughs> one wound <laughs> consistently, one hit consistently, no the wound thing. consistently. The claw. Uh, this is the big one. Four. No. No. <laughs> Two for the sword. Four. Two hits. What are you wounding on? Threes. Threes. Two wounds. We got a rend? Yeah, rend of. Minus two. Uh, that no save, and he's out of the six wounds. He's out of the arc of the or sorry, the range of the cauldron, so no ignore wounds. He's got him. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. We're gonna pile in this way, not that I can trap anybody else, but we'll whatever. We shovel a little bit. Starting off with my sacrificial knives. We're hitting on threes. Everything hit. We're wounding on fours. We got two wounds, no rend, one damage. Four up save. Four up save. One wound down to one. Then the Death Hag's Death Sword hitting on threes, wounding on threes, one with a rend, so five up save. My Kairos. No, D3 wounds, but it doesn't matter because he did. Yep. End of my turn off score, we are tied yet again. So all that matters, turn four, who's going first? Uh, I've got some battle shock here. Oh, it's true. How many, how many did you lose? Uh, I think I lose, lost eight, eight, so it'll be a D6 minus two. Ones I get a D6 back. 
Ooh. Oh, four more. Scratch that. They're being a Bioshock. They had uh, inspiring presence on them. So we're all good over here. So we have to go to turn four. I have to go first one of these turns. No, so here is my three. turn four roll of a one. I got five. And you want me to go first? No. Makes sense. No. All right, Dark Elves, turn four. What are we going to do? Wait, wait, hang on, hang on. So hero phase, <laughs> they both have inspiring presence again. Uh, and I've measured already for spell casting, so I'm gonna just start casting some spells. We yeah. want to start with. I'm gonna start with the um, uh, the gate one. Infernal gateway. Yeah. Or yeah, okay. roll nine dice. Yeah. With the yeah. four plus. So it becomes an eight. Eight. Plus, so it's yeah. Eight. Eight. I yeah, I try to unbind it. Yeah. Show me a nine. No. So close. My college will take a mortal wound on every die. Here is a four plus. So Three nine plus. Dice. Three plus. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five mortal wounds. Yep. The witch inside its own aura will ignore mortal wounds on a five plus. We ignore two of those. And then we also bought the master defense. So we ignore wounds on a six plus as well. Ignoring two more. We take one. Nice. Uh, Down to 12. Ooh. Arcane bolt. Yeah, arcane bolt from... And them? These guys, yeah. Yeah, looking for a uh, five or six, Got it. I forget. I got an eight. That's enough, I can't unbind again. Are you by my one? D3 mortal wounds, it's three. three mortal wounds. We ignore those on a five up. We ignore those again on a six up. Take one wound. Uh, Not bad. And the Lord of Change is gonna do uh, Mystic Shield on... The Pink Horrors? Or the Warriors? The Warriors. The Warriors get the Mystic Shield? Yeah. And that's plenty of enough yep. eight. And they have Mystic Shield. Act Warriors are turning around and going towards the cauldron. We've got to kill you. I'm just being contrary now. I don't know. And the Fate Weaver. No, not Fate Weaver. The Lord of Change. It's going to fly up. To the top. And the Soul Grinder all freed up. He's going to head towards that. No. Yes. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, that thing is up. We're good. You can't make it. Yeah, now it comes. It's pivoting on the claw. And, and the claw ends where the 12, 12, 12 is. <laughs> yeah, that thing's making it in. Pink cores are going to fire up my dark shards, but they're back to hitting on fours because order change flew away and there's low models now. Less than 20. Yeah. No fours! At the crossbows. Hey, I like it. I don't. Four wound. Okay, three. Save. Yep, five up armor save, rerolling ones and twos. Seriously? No. And now this big guy, who's gonna fire at? Are there only two crew on that thing? Only two crew. All right, I'm gonna fire at the crossbows then. Both shots, the cannon and the flame bombardment? Yes. Okay, which one's first? Cannon. Cannon, D6 shots, one hitting on a four. No flim bombardment hitting on a four. <laughs> hey, it is. Only on a three. No. No. <laughs> this guy's on my team. <laughs> Time to charge. He's gonna roll his charge first. Oh no, he's oh, in. <laughs> Seven. Oh, you can go anywhere you want to go. We're just trapping the boss crow. And the chaos words are gonna charge. Ooh, eight. Eight. Going after Does my. Is he really have left? Yeah. That's not good. Yeah. That's not good. Horrors are also gonna make their charge. Going nine, trying to surround that cauldron. Ah. One more charge over here. Five. He's flying. No, he goes. On to combat, the warriors are gonna swing first. Uh, 16 warriors make it into combat. The red dice. Warriors hitting on threes, two's for the champion. Helped a little bit. Four's the wound. We have a five up save. We've done spectacularly well. Then we ignore damage on a five up. And then we ignore damage on a six up. We take one. Oh, shit. And 10. We'll go over here, I guess. <laughs> My guys are hitting on fives. And we're winning on five. Take that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Four up save. Got You're it. Totally fine. And now the pink horrors are gonna go. And 15 of them get to attack. They're hitting on fives though. Yep. Wounding on fours. Three? We have a five up save. <laughs> We're good. Oh, this crew is gonna go, hitting on fives, wounding on, not that, not your that. turn. Not you wanna attack with, oh, your free reign. So you can finish up and then I'll finish up. Where do you wanna start? 
I'll go back to the <laughs> piston driven legs. Six tacks sitting on fours. I am attacking the crew. Yeah. Three hits. Whoa. He's three times as good as he normally is. He's wounding He's on. He's exploding. The threes or fours? He's never wounded before. Two wounds. <laughs> one rend. One rend. Oh, we have five of against that. We take one wound. We're down to one crew. And the gauntlet. Claw. Yeah. Hits on a four. Nope. And the sword. One of these is gonna hit. Two oh. hits. Threes. Threes. One, one wound. Minus two rend. Six up save because of cover. No, we did. We'll just do the fight over oh, okay. here. Just finish up and then I'll finish up mine. <laughs> and two, two attacks of Staff of Zine, shitting on fours. Two hits. Winning on twos. Uh, any rend? Good. Uh, no rend. Five of save. Nope. Two damage each. Yoink. And the curved beak and wicked talons hitting on fours. Nothing. All my attacks are gonna go into the pink horrors from the cauldron. Cauldron's gonna hit with the sacrificial knives on threes. And wound on fours. We have four wounds for the pink horrors. Any rent? Nope. Five of save. And three go down. Death Hag's Death Sword hitting on threes. Then the Death Hag's Blade of Cain hitting on threes. And wounding on fours. One. Rend? No rend. Kills one more. Battle Shock over here. I have a bravery of six. I've lost seven models. And six more are gonna flee. Battle Shock for Pink Horrors, they have bravery 11 or something right now. We lost four models. And they're getting, is it D6? D6 back. D6 back. For rolling a one. Just one coming back. Because whenever demons roll a one on Battle Shock, D6 guys come back. My turn. Hero phase all the things for all the things I do. Uh, two plus for the witches. They're all fine. They're going to run. One inch. Staying on my meteor, but hiding away from everybody else. Shards are going to come on up. And say hello. Which else? Yeah, they're gonna go wide. You don't care about the warriors that much. Dark charge gonna fire at the pink horse in the shooting phase. They hit on fours because so they're the better shooters. And they wound on fours. Two wounds with a five up save for those pink horrors. And they kill two. You guys will fire at the Fate Weaver here, hitting on fives, wounding on fours, two of them, four save, one wound. Oh, Witches are going to charge. Ooh, I'll take the ten. Yep. Boom. I'm gonna have them attack first, because uh, they're butchery. With all their stacked abilities so far, a bunch of attacks hitting on threes. Basically, my Cauldron Hills are wounded in the hero phase. That extra wound was from my Phoenix Stone, and now the Witches are wounding on twos. Five up save for the Pink Horrors. I got Ooh, that's pretty decent actually. And nine of them are gonna die. Chaos Warriors are gonna start piling and attacking next. Yeah. The Warriors are hitting on threes. The Red Dice are the champion who's hitting on twos. On the cauldron. Look at where four is the wound. My cauldron has a five plus armor save. Then my cauldron ignores wounds on a five plus. And then my cauldron also ignores wounds on a six plus. If I get this in my hand proper. This time taking six wounds, down to five. Attack over here. One hit, one wound, <laughs> four up safe. Got You're it. good. Pink cores are gonna attack my witch elves. Fives and fours. No hits. Witch elves are gonna pile in. We got one going this way. We got uh, two going this way. And three going this way. I think that's as far as I can go with them. The rest have to go to the pink cores, which is slide over and actually get them all. On to the pink horrors, we're hitting on threes. We're wounding on twos. Another five up save. And five more gonna die. Is that all of them? Yeah. Beauty. Three more are gonna attack my, or start attack the Chaos Warriors. On threes. And twos. Hey. Four up save. Uh, three up, because they have Mr. Two. Yes, three up. And take two wounds, two guys are gonna die. Over here to attack my bolt thrower, the piston driven legs are hitting on fours. For the usual number of hits. <laughs> There's a wound. Minus one rend. Six up save. Nope. Uh -oh. How much damage? One. Down to three. Hellforge claw. 
Hits on a four. That's a hit. Three. That's a wound. Minus, Minus two. Minus two. No save. D6. D6. Four. It's dead. My cauldron will go after the warriors, I guess. Twelve left. Sacrificial daggers into the warriors. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. We got one. No rend. We're all good. The death sword on threes. And threes with the rend. So four up save because of mystic shield. All good. And the blade of cane, fours and, no sorry, threes and fours. Nothing. Oh. And this final combat. Two attacks, hitting on fours. Twos. Two's a wound. There's a wound. How much rend? Uh, no rend. No rend. Five up save. Hey, we're good. Some beaks. Fours. Fours a hit. You two wounds, or two hits, I say. Threes. Threes a wound. Two uh, wounds. Minus one rend. Six up. Nope, no. they're dead. And you're free. My turn, I'm gonna score and put myself in the lead. Yeah. As we go on to turn five, the last but turn of the round or so last turn of the game. Points. Who's gonna go first? Nope. Didn't get one all game. What do you think? Who's gonna go first? I wanna go first because I wanna block you from scoring. Yep. Okay. So last turn for chaos. Hero phase. Hero phase. He's gonna take the plus one to cast. Yep. And put inspiring presence on the chaos. Too, too far away. Eighteen inches. Twelve. Oh, I thought it was eighteen. Nah, I'm not sure now. <laughs> Infernal gateway. Who's the target? The no. Cauldron of blood. No. You knew. You I knew know this was coming. So this becomes a three. Yes. So roll the seven. Unbind it. Oh yeah. We Whoa. Did. <laughs> Arcane bolt. Where I, was that? I, 13. I, I would not be able to unbind this. This turns into a six, which means a 13. It means I can't even unbind it if I could roll die. So D3 mortal wounds on my cauldron. One, which I ignore in a five, and then I ignore in a six. Nope. Down to four. On to movement, the soul grinder is gonna go nom nom some elves. And the Lord of Change is going to go deny me this objective by going six inches away from the objective. Is it from this? Where do I measure? Just from the edge of the objective. Side. So here's my finger. If you're outside my finger, you're pretty much on it. So staying six max away from the objective. Flying Dying. The Soul Grinders are fires attacks into the L. Starting off with, it doesn't really matter, the D6. D6 attacks. Three. Fours and threes. Fours to hit. Hey! This is your hey. time! Three's the wound. This is your time, Soul Grinder. You've done nothing so far. Okay, yeah, three wounds. Right. I actually kind of want to fill these. I do. You wink. <laughs> then the Flim Marmon hit on a four. Oh, we need a three. What is happening? Yeah. Uh, uh, I have no save. Minus two rend. How much damage? Three. Three damage? We ignore that in a five. Nope. Three would I? Well, I'm going to pull these three. Yeah. What's the risk? Time to charge? Yeah. Soul Grinders are gonna charge. Okay, we're good. And with that failed charge, calculating that the fact that I have three guys on this objective, there's no way for Gwyn to stop me from denying this objective this battle round, which is her last turn. Wait, is, is that true? Oh no, because I failed the charge. Yes, no, okay, yeah. So because these three elves can't die now because of the failed charge, I can't possibly not deny this objective, which means I'm winning by Four points, one round worth of yep. objectives, even though this is denied. So very close, good game. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that is not what I expected to happen. Right here, if this charge made it in, yeah, we've been in trouble. We would I think we would have lost this game. But uh, that, that was close. Is tough. No, rolling three dice for any kind of save, even when it's just six pluses, yeah. things stay alive. That's okay. why the, the Fire Slayers with their five up, five up, five up is just really good. Four up, four up, four up is really good. But even five up, five up, six up is really good. Yeah. There you go. It survived. Good game. Good game, yeah. I still need to point something out. I had an error in my list. Though I did pay for everything correctly point wise, my original list had three units of 10 dark shards. They were bought in 10 minimum. And when I realized I had four battle line, I decided to take one of the 10 man units and split it into two 50, or one of the three 10 man units and split it into two 15 man units. Which wouldn't have been legal. It should have been a 20 man unit and a 10 man unit. But I played with two 15, which I, my bad. I'm sorry. It's okay. Ben caught it. Thanks, Ben. We still had fun. No problem. <laughs> My next game in the vault is going to be with my high elves against death with Graham. It's going to be a 2,000 point battle report with a take and hold scenario. I'll be using uh, the models that came in the old Island of Blood 
of Starship. It's got a new name now. But either way, that's me the Vault. Now, if you already have a Vault memory, click the link below. Get yourself a seven-day free trial to watch that battery port because everything we do at Mini Wargaming, we do in pairs. Thanks for watching. Happy Wargaming.